say that this is the first time in American history in which an HBCU has gone down to nothing and has come back. We have no Dr. Kevin Cosby is proud of the progress Simmons so College has made in recent years. Now the school's leaders are ready to expand their footprint in the California community. This is an economic desert in desperate need of retail and because we have students coming in, then we can replicate uh, in California what is taking place on the campus of the University of Louisville. Cosby says Simmons College was included in a report done by the University of Georgia on the economic impact historically black colleges and universities have in their communities. He says the report revealed Simmons has generated about three million dollars for the city. I want those revenues to come to the black community to one of the poorest zip codes uh, in Louisville and that's the California community. Cosby hosted a community meeting and shared his plans which include closing Garland Avenue. Michael Brooks who is the president of the California Neighborhood Leadership Council says many residents don't like the idea of closing the street. We have an entryway that goes from 15th Street to 18th Street on Garland Avenue. There's also some senior housing at 16th and Garland one block away. This could cause a emergency problem. It could, it could, it could cause, it could, it could be a matter of life or death. Rona Williams lives on Garland Avenue. She is in favor of the plans, including the street closure. It actually will bring the historic college back to the community mm -hmm. and maybe more kids will see a positive and see kids going to college. In West Louisville, Carrie Grace, WLKY News.